got a shirt. I'm what supporter. size did you get? I got a large. Yeah, that's what I did too. <laughs> I don't want that sticking to I me. Know. <laughs> I'm gonna put it on now. I'm with the people. Yes, you are. So some of the signs are pre-written on and some of them are have blank spaces. I've never written on my own sign. I just kind of grabbed the one that fits my vibe. For oh, the day. nice. <laughs> They're residuals, Carol. What could they cost? $10? Not quite my mind, okay, but I get it. The classic's the always classic good. Sign. Yeah, the classic's great. Yeah, I want the classic. Operation Connect with the. She's yes. bringing food, so we'll definitely find it. Definitely. Food. With this nose, I've got it. I'm gonna sniff her out, bro. I'm gonna sniff her out. <laughs> I'm Claritin clear. Margarita, she's behind us. She has the megaphone and she wants to remind you guys to bring your friends, bring your dogs, bring your family. Young people come out, she says. And strike. She's the best megaphone person that I've had so far. I know. Usually I all they say is, don't cross, it's not a cross. Yeah. Also, where's Dee? Dee, where the fuck are you? There she blows. I may send someone out how dedicated people are to me. It is hot as balls. The WPA being out here for over three months now. It was so long for them to be still out here and it's like drones. It's awesome. Drone? Drones? Dro drones? Droves? Drones. Droves. And drones. I Update need... for TWG. I forgot deodorant. And I need them. Both of us smell like shit. Let's check in with Dee in a few. So Dee, where'd you pick that food up from? Sprouts. <laughs> the Democratic Socialists of America, they've been around for a while. And they've been helping the labor movement for a long time now. And what the organization does is help people that are on strikes. And so they've been feeding a lot of the workers that have, that have like gone on strike. Like, we gotta help each other out. So right. Also, I like Dorina's nails. <laughs> oh, they're purple. Yeah. <laughs> hey. The Writers Guild does have better songs. Yeah, they do better songs. <laughs> because they're writers. <laughs> How's my holding form? Um, strong. Okay, cool. Yeah. Peanuts, yeah. I love mini signs. Charles and Schultz would have totally been supportive of this. Peanuts, that's what we're getting paid. Oh. Yes! Okay, I have a question for you. What do CEOs actually fucking do? Uh, a lot of delegating, a lot of suit wearing, they executive. Executive. You know what, Bob Iger? I think that's disgusting. <laughs> what did Ron Perlman say? Careful, motherfucker. Yeah, I have a question. What do CEOs actually do? Most of the time, they're on their phone, kind of like you at home, but they're uh, doing less important stuff than you and, and pretending that they're helping make important decisions. But all they're doing is they're calling their, their buddies at the banks and they're investors and they're like, I got you, bro. I got the writer's money. I got the actor's money. I got all the employees money just for us. See you in our boat party at the end of the year, bro. That's their job. They don't do jack shit. They could be replaced by AI. They could be. So it's not about money. It's about power and greed. It's just disgusting because if it was about money, then they would be saving money by just giving the writers and the actors what they're asking for. And that's what the whole labor movement's about. Like, that's why Amazon's going on strike. That's why the teachers are going on strike. Because it's few people are delegating all the money when they're not contributing shit. And that's why it's important to, right, hospitality industry, that's why it's important to strike for the labor movement in general. It's so obvious how fucked up it is. And that's the part that kills me. Like, we're all like, how do you not get it? The money and the economy should be run by and for the workers instead of billionaires for profit. We're actually supporting everything. He's talking about things that matter, but um, I just think they look hot, so. I learned a staggering stat, a staggering stat today. CEOs make an average of 399 times the amount of the typical worker averaging in their income at 28 million dollars for what for profiting off the other people's work so fuck you guys what don't you understand they executed well the executive should be executed <laughs> what i think here's my guillotine hey hey ho ho corporate greed has got to go hey hey ho, ho. one side now please stay on one side margarita's got so it much for the chance 
this one's for the man. Stick it to him and suck it. <laughs> In a respectful and consensual way. No, um, we just want fair wages and AI not to take over and for just a livelihood that's worth living. Remember, there's a lot of ways you can actually help uh, if you're not able to go to a picket line. Remember, there's more of us than the greedy locals in power. And SAG and WGA, they're asking everybody to post, spread the message. There's something you can do just from home. So please spread the love and uh, way, to, way to protest today, ladies. Power to the people. Power to the people. Oh, yeah. Fuck you, fucks. This is a very inspiring time to be in this country as many people are struggling and seeing how many people are actually taking action. It's happening in every industry. So many people are living in survival mode. Everyone should have the right to food, to housing, to a living wage. There is enough going around. It's just being distributed unequally. Employers spend in the hundreds of millions of dollars a year in union busting tactics. They could use the millions that they spent on lawyers that are anti-union on actually paying their workers and it would be way less money. Remember, there's more of us than them. We are so glad you're here and there's so many ways that you can help. If you're someone like Bob Iger or David Saslov or Ted Sarandos, I hope that you really look inward if you can take the time to remember that you have a soul and know that you're fine, man. You're very comfortable and other people are struggling and we're not gonna shut up about it until you actually give what's fair. Thanks for listening to me yell about justice and peace. I am sweaty as balls, so I'ma go shower and listen to Raging as a Machine. Si se puede.